a good portion of my month, my week, my day is spent talking to chief supply chain officers and COOs about how do they make decisions around technology. I consider myself someone who is very interested in deploying technology to help enable my team. But even though I actually enjoy this topic, I cannot stay on top of all of the, the new solution sets and companies that are coming out almost every single day with something new. There is so much technology right now that they have to consider. So, you know, if you look at investments in AI adoption and sourcing or automation efforts and logistics or robotics and manufacturing, it's all, it's all happening. In a company that is over 200,000 employees with 340 manufacturing locations, in 188 countries, there's a high level of complexity. But what we're finding is more of the opportunity or challenge along this journey is to really find the right solutions for each of the markets. Everything for me is just rooted in fundamentals. There are so many technologies that are popping up everywhere today, but you truly have to understand, can they solve your complex, dynamic business problem on a consistent basis. The biggest challenges that, that we've seen in getting uh, AI and digitization up and running is the overall integration into the foundational systems and the tech stack. And so you want a bunch of heterogeneous systems working seamlessly together. So the way that Google is evaluating in emerging technologies is, is kind of through multiple lenses. The first one is, does it uh, give us productivity and efficiency gains? The second one is, does it integrate into our current tech stack and give us the visibility that we need? And then and the third one is, does it give us the, the resilience and the agility that we need? It's not about destroying what we have. It's more about layering on top the things we need to really drive value. You'll always need an ERP to transact purchases, but that is not really the solution that drives value. So we need to really layer on top, you know, all of these best in breed solutions. There's a reality that not every technology will fit your business environment. You have to be able to try some things out. You have to be comfortable with failing and looking for what truly works within your environment. I think the best decision makers on technology and supply chain are going to be able to just have this visibility of their operation, look up, see the world out in front of them, see people who are doing things that might be at the forefront, you know, winning, definitely making mistakes, and fast follow into those things. What they're not going to do is have a thousand different experiments happening in supply chain all day, every day that don't connect. 